But now my biggest concern is that we're doing this in the dark. Like, the rift activity is calm, but there's still a bear looking around. Now, do I want it going through here? Actually, I think yes. Let's go through here. Well, we can't pick up the... Dirt blocks just yet. Just burn this off first. It's a little bit steep, though. Maybe we should just push this back just a little bit. Oh, we should just dump this now. Just so we can pick up these blocks. Just fill this in and then put this here. Okay, so let's start putting down these paths. And we will at least have an easy time scaling this. Probably not something I should be doing right now. I don't think it's gonna reach. Like, there's gonna have to be a steep part somewhere. Uh, let's dig this out. Uh, 
Unless we wanted to like... Probably should have done that part first. Because now this part is already there. And I could have probably just cut this out. Uh, I knew that was going to happen. You know what? Let's do this later. Maybe we can just fill in this part. Yeah, so it's supposed to go like this. But I want to keep it to one tile. Like, I just keep it to put it at two tiles wide. Just in certain places, just so I know where stuff is supposed to go. But otherwise, we should just keep it as one tile first. I don't even know which side the second uh, tile is supposed to go in this spot. Oh, okay. So it's supposed to go here. So we just mark it here just so that I know that it's supposed to go there. Yeah, so we do it like that. And then... Ooh, I know what to use a dwarf fuse for. With dwarf furs. Like, I remember I was having a trouble with a flower over here. It was like blocking one of these things. Like, it was in the way of preventing me from seeing, like, what was in here. What the hell? It was one of these. Unless I just took out the flower and then didn't replace it with anything else. Okay, so it was this one. That's what I was having trouble with, so we'll put a flower there. Anyway. Let's go use up the rest of this stuff. Might as well just clear this out now, because I am going to be putting down stone paths later on over here. Okay, how are we doing here? Still not going. Like, I do have another set of windmill sails, but that's not tall enough, and I don't feel like moving it. We'll just put this in here. Thirty-two quick limes. That's. Wait a minute. So, ten liters. We need forty of this. So we just need eight liters to make the slaked lime, and then we'll just get the sand later on. There we go. So we just need 32 blocks of sand, and then that'll be good to go. 7 out of 9. All of this is 7 out of 9.
All right, so let's organize this inventory now. So we got 27 resin at this point. Got the Jonas parts here. Got more clay here. Uh, put the stone pads back, I guess. And then put this here. Put this here. Yeah, I guess we'll keep the temporal gear here as well. So, we're still gonna need a lot more fire clay. I just went on that side mission for the stone paths there. Like it just felt like it was it was taking too long for me to decide what I want to do with that path, like going up the hill. So I decided to move on to something else. Now our food is that's one day and eight hours. Let's eat our berries and then we'll continue harvesting the clay here. We'll get this segment over here. Okay, that... that looks almost clear. It really does take way too much time and effort to make these fire clay bricks. Now I'm wondering, does anybody know anyone who has done like clay bricks, either blue clay bricks, blue clay bricks or fire clay bricks? Because I don't think I've seen that before from anyone. Everyone either has these cobblestone huts that they spent like a bajillion hours on or like straw huts or whatever. Like I've never seen anyone using clay bricks before. So let me know if there's anyone out there. I want to see their builds. That's a real good thing that I got that second shovel earlier, because I'm not even depleted this yet, but I am just using a lot of shovels. Just digging out so many clay blocks. I don't think I've dug up this many clay blocks like in any other playthrough. This is most I've done. But I guess that also means, like, I don't have, like, large quarries of just digging out lots of rocks. But it just seems so much faster if I just, like, dig out quarries and got my building materials that way. Like, this is just, like, too much. But I'm already... I've already committed this far, so I might as well just continue this. So I'm going to have a fire clay brick house as well as a fire clay brick, like, windmill. I should start converting these into bricks. In fact, I should have probably dumped these out earlier. Well, anyway, let's 
Keep this going. I'm probably going to deplete this entire deposit. And it's a pretty big deposit at that. Uh, probably should do this. I'm going to fill up my inventory entirely with clay bricks and then I'm going to fire them all up. And then I'm going to do the tedious task of getting more sticks. Like, we should have plenty of grass at this point because I was getting so much of it during the temporal storm. Speaking of which, I do need some new shears. Okay, so maybe I'm not going to be depleting this p deposit just yet, but still taking a lot of clay. Now the reason I'm not taking this spot over here is because of the water. I don't want it spilling all over the place. And destroying the cattail roots. Oh. I need to do this. There we go. I have a lot of fire clay bricks once again. Or maybe I can take out this entire layer. Okay, another stack of fire clay bricks. Maybe like one more stack. Yeah, I probably should check on the ingots. They probably cooled down by now. And so did the molten stuff inside the crucible. I just wasn't thinking about that. Like, it did pass by the house and just didn't bother with it at all. Okay, let me just finish this stack. Actually, let's take one spare stack just for clay forming stuff. Like, I still need to do uh, the crocs. And there we go. One more stack of this, and then fill it up with raw clay.
I think we're good to go at this point. Oh yeah, these cattails have grown back at this point. Now I do need to do something about this stone. We need to fill it up with dirt. Okay, let's start putting these down. Wonder if I have enough to actually fill up this entire thing. I think I might. Oh, let's see. I'm almost there. Yeah, I have enough. That is still a lot of fire clay bricks, though. So we're just going to dump our spares here. Wow, this is insane. Oh, that is rotating quite quickly. That's almost done. Uh, let's, let's just put the clay in here. Now, where did I put the extra stone paths? Like the half slabs over here. Here's some hay. Like, I could have sworn I had more half slabs. It's not in here. Uh... I guess, um... Yeah, we'll do the hay. But we're gonna need to get some more sticks. Oh, come on, really? Oh, come on, really? You just burn this off. You know, since I'm close by, like, I probably should have started burning this earlier, but since we're, like, really, really close by. Let's harvest these berries. Now, what I want to do here, while this is all burning, I'm going to go collect some sticks. I probably should put the hay in the stuff there first. 
in the pit kilns. It's like I'm doing things in the wrong order. That's okay. Let's continue lighting this on fire. It is just too brushy in here. So, gotta do something about that. Okay, let's torch this one. Like, this might seem counterproductive since I kind of need this brush here for the fuel, but at the same time, I need to get some sticks. So I kind of have to balance it out. Because if I take off too much brush for the sticks, then it's not going to have enough fuel to spread. Also need to be careful because there was a black bear and some wolves around here and I don't think I killed them off. What is that? Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go hunting. But I want to get these pit kilns fired up first, so that's why I'm doing it this first. Okay, so let's let that go for now. Thing is, it's probably better to get sticks near the resin site I have to the west of the temporary base. Because that has a lot of pine trees and that actually has much denser quantity of sticks there, so... Oh, this thing escaped being burned. And so did this. So yeah, let's get this going. And this is done. So I'm gonna have to put another 32 halite in there. But we need to start dumping all of this stuff. <laughs> 